is CNN. I just feel like I have so much to give, but sometimes you can be so full of resentment. Why is that? Perhaps I talk too much. Maybe I come on a little too strong. Sometimes even I overreact. Okay. So CNN concatenated is an 18 minute long monologue in a sense that's composed from thousands of uh, very small clips uh, recorded on the cable news network. If we're going to be in this relationship for some time, we may as well begin working on this together now. It's not enough to turn me on once in a while. It's not enough for you to turn to me every time you need something. I started the piece earlier um, than 2001 and began collecting material, not really knowing what I was going to do with it, and began to form sort of very primitive sentences with these little words that I was collecting. The statistics and their partisan priorities. Between the Middle East and the Far West. Between the Midwest and the Far East. Between the coasts and the swing states. Between the standards of reporting and the measures of the demographic tastes. Between the spy plane and the space station. Civilians on submarines and billionaires in orbiting vacations. Between and then the I moved to Germany on September 1st, 2001 and while sitting in German classes learning a language and writing down words uh, and reciting them, I uh, uh, heard about uh, the uh, attacks in, on the uh, World Trade Center and realized that the piece, in a sense, would have to change. I kept ordering VHS cassettes from uh, CNN of the aftermath. And through that footage, uh, the challenge was to, to sort of articulate uh, a voice uh, to, to, to try to locate a voice that sort of responds to all of that uh, or rather speaks through it at the same time. Where do our responsibilities begin? Where do our needs end? What have we done to deserve this? What could we have done to prevent it from happening? What can we learn? Where do we go from here? What do we know? How have we changed? What should we have done differently? Who can we trust? But if the work succeeds, it's when you pass that point, you begin to almost close your eyes with all the clutter and with all the sort of noise that it makes and begin to listen to that voice, you know, that's speaking through the footage. You know, and that voice is a pretty scared, it's a pretty scared voice, it's a pretty sort of urgent, demanding, aggressive, uh, scared voice. I don't know what to say. Uh, you know, that voice is, is, I suppose in a way, the, the kind of, those sort of agents or the doppelganger that I use for me. Every time I try to speak carefully, I fuck up and make a big mess of it all. To begin with, has that occurred to you? Well.